Suppose you have an idea that microwaves can help your process. Well, what I'd like to do is take you through a number of steps just to determine whether it's actually worthwhile you pursuing this. And these are steps that you can do yourself. So the first thing to determine is, does your product actually heat? Well, this can be done very simply by placing some of your product inside a microwave oven, measure the initial temperature, turn the oven on for 20 seconds, measure the temperature again, and see if you can identify any temperature rise. If you get some temperature rise, no matter how small, then most likely microwaves will heat your product. The next step is to determine what exactly is the advantage that you want. <clears throat> now, assuming it is faster processing times, what you need to do is take some of your product, put it back in the microwave oven, and continually be switching the oven off and on for, say, a period of 20 seconds, and look for your process being completed in a faster time period. Now, if you find any evidence at all within the bulk of material that you place in the oven that the processing time has been shortened, then you can be sure that microwaves will give you the advantage that you want. Now, just because you haven't got a completely uh, homogeneous product at the end doesn't matter because a microwave oven is designed to heat two litres of water. And with a specifically designed applicator, we can give you a homogeneous product. Once you've established that, that yes, you can get the uh, product advantage that you're looking for with microwaves, the next step is to calculate how much energy you need. So using the heat balance equations, if you can calculate how much energy you need, you will then have an understanding of the kilowatts connected. So the microwave power in kilowatts that are connected for your process. From that, we can establish what the rough capital cost is going to be. And just as a rough guide, 2,000 to 4,000 US dollars per kilowatt will be what it'll cost to implement your process full scale. And that cost will depend largely upon the materials handling requirements.